Hey guys, how are we doing? Mr. Wilco here, back again to follow up on that lesson where we introduced that song and you briefly heard me play a new chord, the G7. Now, the first three chords that you've learnt, the C, the F, and this new G7 that we're about to put on, they are the most commonly used songs for anyone learning a ukulele to begin with. Okay, some people will learn the C7, but that's not one that I tend to really focus on too much. I don't see it used a lot in songs that the kids are that keen on, but definitely if you find something that you want to use, then definitely consider that one. That will be part of the chord bank as well. So let's look at this G7. I'm going to take my stickers again, and I'm going to show you how to place these in the right spot. This time, I'm going with blue. Now, just talking about the stickers for a second, whilst I place these in a moment in their correct position, once you've gotten beyond these three chords, we're not going to just be putting stickers anywhere. So even though in that chord bank I've got different colours for the various chords, it's not necessary that you put stickers. We can't have stickers all over because a lot of positions are the same for different chords, different finger positions. So we're just going to end up with a ukulele full of full of dots. That's not the ideal thing, but like I mentioned, once you've gotten used to at least the first three chords, you're going to have a good idea about firstly training your fingers to have that muscle memory to move about different places, get into the right positions and get a good sound from those positions. That's another thing that we'll speak of in a minute. Um, once you've got that in place, you won't need those stickers anymore and you'll be able to take them off. But for the time being, let's add these blue dots. So we're going to place the first of our blue dots underneath the second string in the first fret. So here I go, under the second string in the first fret. There you go. Second string, first fret. Yes, it's in the same position as another one. But do not panic. Let's grab our second blue dot. So we've got three dots that we're going to place on this time. Second blue dot is going to go on the third string. One, two, three. And the second fret. One, two, three. Second fret. And our third is going to go on the first string. Second fret. So yours should look like this when you are holding it. Okay, that is a G7. Okay, so let's look at what we've got. We've got using our third finger. Using my third finger, I'm going to play a C. Now I've got these two fingers ready to go to my green dots. That's my F. There's my F. Green back to red to C F C F. Hopefully you're getting better at practicing moving between those two. Remember the finger is it's it's everything. Using the correct finger. Okay, so let's look at this new one here. If you see it, this first finger is already used to being in that spot because of the F. Now all that we have to do we're going to be here from our C, F. This one's going to slide back, and these ones are dropping up on there. Okay. Try practicing moving between the red, sliding back, adding those two. Red, red, blue, blue, red, red, blue, blue, red. You might stay on one for a bit longer. Red, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ten. Now one thing you will notice about my hand here, and this is something a lot of kids and well, any students have difficulty with, is 
getting a good sound out of it, they'll say, oh, I can't, I can't fit my fingers in. And it's true, it is difficult, especially on a smaller ukulele. So what happens is we need to give ourselves room with our wrist, sliding it, shuffling it back, giving yourself room to fit that in. So you might be playing in this position here, and then as you go back, we're gonna slide it back. And I'm always standing my fingers up. How can you see it? Standing them up. If they drop flat, it's not gonna be a good sound, okay? C, F, G7, C, F, G7. Try and practice moving between those. La, la, bomba. La, la, bomba. La, la, bomba. La, 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 What's happening guys? Mr. Wilco here. Check it in. Time for the song. Let's take it a bit more seriously. A little bit, just for a second. C, F, G7. Let's check that tuning. My dog has fleas. Right eh, for the song. You are my sunshine. My Please don't take my son. 